and welcome to Vlogmas Day 17. Today I am so excited for this video. I cannot even tell you. I am so excited. I finally get to film a haul for you. Oh my god, I feel like it's been such a long time since I filmed my last haul video. Today I will show you some of the pieces I got from ASOS and H&M as well. Everything arrived and I will show it all. I will show you the pieces first and then I will also show you some try-on clips. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. I actually want to start off with two pieces that I am wearing right now. First of all, this super nice, this super nice bodysuit, which is from, well, I ordered it on ASOS and it is Sally Varios, and I think this is like 17.99 or something. But also, ASOS had like 20% off here in Germany, and I obviously paid a little less than the original retail price. So this nice flat bodysuit, and then also this cardigan. But I'm gonna show you that in full in my mirror because it is so long, so long. I don't know how to make this work. It's like almost up my ankles. So uh, I need to show you that cardigan in my mirror. I'll be right back. So this is the cardigan, everyone. I'm so obsessed with it. And I already wore this and everyone like came up to me and asked me where I got this from. I absolutely love it. Also the detail here. And I am wearing a size small in this. And the bodysuit is a size medium. I'm pretty sure I picked a size medium just because of the length <laughs> and then I'm wearing a size small in the cardigan and this one was around like 70 euros I think it's alright for, for that kind of cardigan the next piece I want to show you is another blazer you know I'm obsessed with them I cannot go without a blazer in my wardrobe and it's this gorgeous one from ASOS and it's got shoulder pads. I'm not sure about that. I know it's it's a trend at the moment but I, I feel like my shoulders are already quite wide and I don't want to enhance that. Maybe that is not the right thing for me but you'll decide as I try it on. So this is the blazer everyone. I'm not sure about it. I'm really not. I really want an oversized blazer but every time I try one of these blazers. They just look too big and really weird on me. And then the shoulder pads are not really making it any better. This is from the ASOS design range, by the way. And I'm wearing a size 36, which is a US, no, UK size 8. And US size 6, I think. US size 4. I'm really not sure about it. I feel like it's just too much for me. I don't think I'm going to keep that. And also it was quite expensive I think. I think this was like almost 100 euros. So for someone like me who's used to buying blazers from Zara and Mango, this is actually quite a lot for a blazer but I can't tell you the price for sure. I will link everything in the description box down below so you can check it out. Okay everyone, can I just say something? I was about to try on the bodysuits I ordered from ASOS which are by Misguided. It's a double pack and they are tied together, okay? How am I supposed to try these on? One bodysuit just hanging loose somewhere at my bottom. How is that supposed to work? Someone please explain that to me. That is the situation. It's tied together. I can't show you. I'm sorry. I will I will try to figure this out. These are two simple bodysuits and I will link them for you anyway, but I don't get how I am supposed to try them. This is the worst thing. Why do these things always happen to me? I feel like I'm, I always come off as such an idiot um, because these things just happen to me. Why? Why? And someone please explain to me why you were tied together to bodysuits so no one can actually try them on. Please let me know the reason behind that. And the last piece I got from ASOS is this head. I forgot what this is called. Oh my god. I work in fashion and I forgot what this hat is called. I think it's, it's is it a barrette hat? Someone please let me know that. I'm gonna try it on. Like this. Oh yes. Oh my god, yes. Am I doing this the right way? Like this is so nice. This looks really cool. I'm going to figure out how to wear this because I actually really like it that way, maybe. I don't know, I look so silly right now. I'm gonna figure this out. But I do like this one. And about the bodysuit I mentioned from Stradivarius, I don't think I'm going to keep it just because now that I've changed into something else, I realise that the material is actually quite tight and I couldn't really, you know, let loose. I felt like a bit stiff in it. 
so I don't think I'm going to keep that. Let's move on to the H&M pieces. The first piece from H&M I want to show you is this gorgeous jumper. Oh, this is so beautiful and it is completely what I love. It's like such a typical thing for me. Then I got this in a size small, I think. Yes, small. I can't tell you the price because it doesn't say on here. But I think it was around 40 euros. I absolutely love it. Though I'm not sure I'm going to keep it just because I have so many jumpers. Let's face it, I am in lockdown and I always keep the heating up so I will not be wearing such a thick jumper at home. I would only wear it at work. I don't really know if I need that kind of jumper but I'm gonna try it on anyway. Well this is really gorgeous when you try it on and I tucked it a little bit just so it wouldn't like come down here because it is quite long at least for me and because you can see no skin other than my face and my hands i feel like you don't want to make it too long just to sort of elongate your own body by tucking it a little bit and that is also something that is really helpful when you're short just like i am yes i love it it feels like quite harsh on the skin it's a little bit scratchy there's wool in it so that's normal but i don't think I'm going to keep it because I won't get much wear out of it. But it is absolutely beautiful. So far, the only piece I'm definitely keeping is the cardigan. And then from H&M, I also got this roll neck shirt. It is very thin. I'm wearing a size small in this and it's definitely enough. But because it is so thin, you just want to wear something underneath. And by that, I don't mean just, you know, uh, skin colored underwear. I mean like you want to wear a black top underneath just because it is really see-through. This is such a go-to for me. Underneath a blazer, underneath a denim jacket, leather jacket, anything. Um, these kind of shirts are just the best and I'm definitely going to keep it. I think it was only around 10 euros. H&M does such good shirts and tops and stuff for wearing underneath things like layering. I absolutely love it. Another one of those typical Ronak shirts from H&M in this like nude beige color. And again, it was like 10 euros, I think, or 15, I don't know. And this time it's a little bit thicker in material and it also is ripped. I probably should have put on a different shirt underneath because I'm still wearing my black top. <laughs> don't do that. I really like this. And I also took off my necklace for a second because I was afraid of actually breaking it um, by trying on these raw neck shirts. I want to show you the last piece I got from H&M and I'm freaking out about this. I really wanted a new handbag. I had the Longchamp one. I don't know, I've just been looking for a new handbag that, that would be like big enough for me to just throw everything in there. And I found this one, which is like a fake fur type of thing and it's literally the first. I already have all of my stuff in here so it is quite heavy. I don't think it is too big but I can still fit everything in here. And I absolutely love it. And they also have this in like a grey version, grey beige type of thing. But I feel like black is the one for me just because it doesn't get as dirty as like one of those neutral light colours. Or at least you won't be able to see it because you can't wash this. Anyway, I think it is a really good handbag and it was only 30 euros. So completely fine. So that is it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then please give it a thumbs up. Let me know which pieces I should keep and which I should return. And if you want to shop anything for yourself, everything is listed in the description box down below. If you want to see more content from me and you want more fashion advice and anything that is like beauty stuff, then please subscribe to my channel. It truly means the world to me. And I'm so grateful for every single one of you. I cannot even put it into words. I'm, I'm literally so grateful. And I feel like everyone's saying that and I've been saying it, but I truly feel that way. You can honestly believe that. And I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.